million. Monday's slide happening about 125 miles east of the Utah border, closing the highway from Glenwood Springs to Gypsum. Right now, high winds are hurting repair efforts, pushing back the reopening to the weekend. Scam alert for you this morning. Scammers are calling on the phone claiming to be an employee of the El Paso County Sheriff's Office. They're going as far as giving a badge number and they're threatening the victim if they don't follow instructions and clear up a warrant. The Sheriff's Office making it clear they will never ask for money for any reason. Well, Last night marked part two of the Republican Town Hall featuring candidates John Kasich, Jeb Bush, and Donald Trump. Yeah, the three took questions from voters during the last major event have been lost. Next, the Rocky Mountain National Park is third busiest park in the U.S. The Colorado reports the park was the fifth most visited national park for 2014, but it jumped to the third place spot after getting ahead. 708 is your time. Celebrities from Star Trek, Walking Dead, and Zombie are going to be in Southern Colorado. That's right. Up next, we're going to tell you about this event. And welcome back at 743 right now. Well, it started in the streets and moved to the stage now. While many say that breakdancing may have just faded away, it turns out it never left. Fox 21's Christina DeWittowitz introduces us to local breakdancers who show us why it's more than just a dance.